Hi everyone, it's Darla at Scrap Happens here with Tuesday's Tip. Today I want to teach you a fun technique called rock and roll. It's really fun and you can listen to some great music while you do it. <laughs> so let's get started. Um, I used the Healing Hugs stamp set to create this card. And I'm going to show you how I did it. I used Daffodil Delight ink, Crushed Curry ink, and Old Olive ink. I also used some rhinestones and some sequins. The sentiment is stamped with the same stamp set. I used Versamark with white embossing powder on um, basic black cardstock to get that look. One of my favorite parts of this stamp is the little X's or um, crosses. I love how that's stamped, so I wanted to be sure. A lot comes to this stamp set, it's really fun. So let me show you how to do the rock and roll technique. My table's a little grouped, so I have some cardboard under here to make it solid. I have a pre-cut piece of Whisper White cardstock. I cut it in three and three quarters inch by five inch. And the first thing I'm gonna do is ink up my flower with the Daffodil Delight ink. Next, I'm gonna take my crushed curry ink um, and I'm gonna rock it and I'm gonna roll it just on the edges of the stamp. This is an old technique. Many of you might have already done it, but for some of you who haven't or some of you new stampers, it's a really fun, fun te technique. And there you have it. So what that does is it darkens your edges and gives you a little more detail. Even though um, this stamp already has a lot of detail, it adds more. Then I just stamped my leaves. And I stamped my X's in Daffodil Delight. That was an afterthought. I was hiding a mistake, but I thought it was super cute. <laughs> and then I added my sentiment on the bottom and matted it on a four by five and a quarter piece of old olive cardstock and then onto a five and a half by eight and a half piece of Whisper White cardstock. Super cute. Super easy, fun effect. I hope you'll give it a try. Thank you so much for stopping by today. Subscribe to my channel if you like what you're seeing. Check out my Facebook page. Um, and check out my blog, Scrap Happens Here with Darla.com for more inspiration. Have a great day, and I'll see you next week with Tuesday's Tip. Bye.